Um, it takes time to get used to the noises, and especially if you live on your own. Because, you know, when you have somebody else in the house, you always assume, even other noises, you always assume like the other person. But all of a sudden, when you're upstairs and you hear your wood uh, like going like on the ground floor. <laughs> <laughs> Concentrate and think, okay, it's an old house and it's yeah. made of wood. Yeah. And uh, you know, there is wood under the carpet, so sometimes it just goes like <laughs> on its own, it's fine. And sometimes it's the neighbors, they move something over there and then <laughs> something else reacts over this side. So but it's I'm I'm really enjoying it. and my my street is so lovely with a lot of trees and uh, nice. Yeah. And it's a much younger, a much vibrant, much more vibrant street. And, uh, but Chizik is as well, it's quite green. It's oh, nice. it is. And that's one of that's the thing that I thought I was going to miss Lowe's, the, the fact that it's so green. Because, you know, being Angolan, I was, you know, I was always surrounded by nature, by, by, um, by life, you know. If it, if it was not the land, if it was the green of the trees or whatever. And here, because it's, you know, when you go to central London, it's, it's harder sometimes to remember, you know, any piece of nature. But in Chiswick, because it's, there is, I think in, in one mile radius from where I lived, I had like four or five parks. Okay. And it was just, it was so nice. But it was a big decision for you to move there. It, it was, it was a big because decision. Because I think it's everyone that would prefer to live in Chiswick, you know. It's yeah. It's a little bit expensive as well, which is it? Yeah, and I made my family there. It's oh, your family is there? No, 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 my whole family is in Angola, but like, uh -huh. I, I made my own family, okay. you know what I mean? I had a lot of friends and a lot of people who I knew and knew me and, you know, even from local shops, you know, just people who became my friends. That's and also cute. my, yeah, and also my ex drama school. Are you still going to drama school or just uh, you finished? Or? No, I finished, but it's, it's, um, you know, I, I, of course I know a lot of people from there, the teachers and, you know, some of the, uh, the students and mm -hmm. even some of the alumni also live in the area, so it was really nice to be there and to feel connected to that. But what do you do now? Just tell me, please. What exactly your project or what is uh, what you do? Now I'm bonding place. <laughs> that's what I can do because <laughs> I'm an actress, so that's what I do. You know. Um, Maybe some new something or. I finished a play last week, uh -huh. and uh, I was invited to do two more, but I. Uh, well, I had I had to decline. Um, Why? I had to decline uh, because I felt like I just needed to take some time for you know for myself and also it's the summer you know I, I wanted to have some time to go abroad if I need to or, you know just to go on holiday. But you planning to go? I am I am planning, but I'm I'm taking you know I'm, I'm trying not to hold on to any plans. Well, exactly, any... you planning. Where? Mm -hmm. I might visit my mum because she is going to Portugal in a okay. few weeks' time. So, I would like to go and visit the road. No, I have decided to just travel a little bit. <laughs> yeah, it's fun just to, you know, not to get caught up in the wheel of work, work, work and actually do something that you know, allowed me more freedom. So yeah, I want that. I'm looking forward to it. But I think I'm gonna I'm gonna do at least one of the plays that I was that I was asked to do. Yeah. Something different little bit in life. Yeah, it's it's a musical play this one. <laughs> it's gonna be fun. <laughs> I don't know. I'm still actually I'm still making up my mind, so I, I actually don't know. Hey, you can see my head again. <laughs> it's you. <laughs> it's you. 
which one I know him long time ago mm -hmm. he just bought the apartment there mm -hmm. and he just came to me for haircut actually just a uh, few days ago yeah and he says if you would like go and stay there just uh, very close to the sea and uh, you don't need to take anything just mm -hmm. go and stay That's That's awesome. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Really, really lovely. I hope you take Ma Malaga. Can you hear Malaga? Ah, Malaga, yeah. Oh, it's beautiful. Let's maybe try to do this myself. Yeah. Because I was looking actually for Spain, you know, but he just came and just proposed me this one, you know. Yeah. Excellent. I didn't need to do, you know, research or something like that. Mm. Yeah, and that's the law of attraction in potion, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, sounds good. Actually, a friend of mine has been inviting me to go to to go to Spain also for mm -hmm. a long time, for years. Every year, I said, oh, this year maybe, and then I end up not going. <laughs> uh, but yeah, you should definitely do it because I'm sure you're gonna have loads of fun. Yeah, yeah. And the food and the heat and oh, you know, food, yeah. And people are so. I think that was my fight. <laughs> this way. Yeah. Why? Yeah, because I'm just getting fat. No, I don't say that. You look awesome. But usually, you know, my sister when she was going to Spain, all that she coming back, you know, just a put a couple of pounds. <laughs> no, <laughs> food is nice, and at least the summer is, uh, you know, proper summer. Because here, yeah. have a look, already June, you know, it's gone almost, yeah. Yeah, and it's still <laughs> raining. Yeah, the last few days were. Oh my God, it was so grey. It was so great. I thought someone painted the sky. It was just so great. It felt like it was on purpose. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But today we're having a nice day. It's lovely today, yeah. Yeah. Apparently it's supposed to, to rain very soon as well, but at least for now we're enjoying the sun. That's good. Yeah, you're used to it, isn't it? But it's gonna be for children if the summer is gonna be, you know, holiday. It's not gonna be fair to them, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Devoted. Yeah. Yeah. But on another, you know, of course, it's <laughs> bearing in mind that I'm a Europe, uh, you know, I have a European passport and I'm living here. Of course, I was a little bit worried. But on the other hand, I I actually do like when the. Uh, Democratic processes. <laughs> I think you know, gonna be fine, you know. Yeah, I, I think so too. Of course. How long have you been here? Five years. Is it five or is it gonna be five or six years now? No, it's gonna be six years. Is six it? years, yeah. In September, I came to yes, I came in 2010, so it's going to be six years in September. Oy, oy. Yeah, but you you planning to stay here for good or? just you will see or uh not not for good to be honest not for good but i i it's funny because i don't i don't see life as permanent as other people because and also because my job is relatively flexible you know um and i've always been a not always but i've been a migrant for a long time ever since i was 11 that's when i migrated the first time mm -hmm. so it's you know i don't see I find I find England, I find London